During the Hunter, about 300 women every year develop gestational diabetes. This has been an increase of about 300% over the last five years. They're at a very high risk of going on to develop type 2 diabetes within five to 10 years. It also means that their children are at high risk of future type 2 diabetes. And the tragedy is that once you deliver your baby, there's actually currently no services that you can attend to help lower your risk of future type 2 diabetes. That's what our project is addressing. We have an intervention that will help with that. So our approach is to combine a website that's tailored to women of this age group. That website will contain information on healthy eating and physical activity with one-on-one uh, -on -one video consultations with a dietitian and an exercise physiologist. The reason that we've selected these particular type of technologies is based on our research and identifying what women want in this age group. Essentially they want access to services and technologies that suit their lifestyle, particularly when you've got a new baby. We would like to thank Diabetes Australia and the Hunter Medical Research Institute for the funding that's supporting this project.